welcome to nikki's and aura's vlogs today we are sharing our journey experience to oman through hatta border the trip was an unexpected and unplanned we started our journey at 6 am from al kiada metro station to udmeta metro station from udmeta metro station through exit 1 we can get e16 bus to hatta there is one more option to go to hatta bus station by dubai mall there we can catch h02 bus and go to hatta bus station it was a 2 hours journey from udmeta bus station to hatta bus station the journey from udmeta bus station to hatta bus station cost only 10 ad we can use our metro card and travel from udmeta to hatta there are different options where we can travel to hatta border like traveling with our own vehicle with proper insurance and prior rta approval for the vehicle we are traveling and using rta bus like e16 h02 the next option will be al kanjuri transportation they have the office in dera we can book from there another option is from hatta there is one travels from there we can book a man taxi the taxi charges will be varying differently we paid around 250 ad to cross the border till sohar both sides we can see lot of mountains and it is like a hill area in vacation time it is a nice plan to travel from dubai to oman or hatta it is a nice place we can spend lot of time with our family and friends Hatta is a beautiful hill station where we can do so many activities like Hatta Swan Lake, Hatta Heritage Village, Hatta Wadi Hub, Hatta 360 Arbitrary, Al Wadi Park, Hatta Sign, Hatta Horse Ride Center, Hatta Lane Lake, Hatta Honey Bee Discovery Center and Hatta Dam. We reached Hatta bus station by 9:15 a.m. From Hatta bus station to Hatta border cross it is almost 10 kilometers. And this is the Hatta express bus from Dubai Mall which cost around 25 AD from Dubai Mall to Hatta. Actually, we plan to cross the border by walking, but it was not allowed, and we were back from border to Hatta again, and we booked a taxi. With the help of Hatta Sky Travel and Tourism, we booked an Oman taxi from Hatta. With the help of Oman taxi, we crossed the border. The exit fee was 36 AD per person. After a long journey, we reached 
so far by 4:30 these are some oman currency we got from our friends in oman aed also accepted in shops on the same day we went to cornish and also sohar beach we spent time over there with our friends and we had dinner the next day was eid day and early morning we got ready and went for a lunch with our friends we had a nice mutton biryani with them we visited sultan qaboos grand mosque in sohar the mosque was very big and it was having a large area The mosque was having so many architectural works on its walls which was amazing. In Sohar we went to buy Oman special halwa We passed by Sultan Palace area also through road. Sohar is a beautiful place with less traffic as compared to Dubai. We stayed with our friends and the overall expense was around 300 AD to and fro per person. We won't be able to find so many high-rise buildings like in Dubai. In Soha, there are buildings of same color. We started our journey from Soha by 5:30. with the help of that Oman taxi driver who dropped us we reached the border by 6:30 and we went inside the immigration and they stamped the exit in our passport and we crossed the Oman border first then Hatta border We reached safely Dubai by 8:30 p.m. The journey was really adventurous that we had not planned to cross the Hatta border like this. If you like this travel video, please subscribe my channel and do like, share and comment.